Hello, my friends and geese and other folks and other geese and other birds. Like ducks, I guess. Ducks are welcome, as are swans and pigeons. And I guess... Uh... Sparrows, maybe? Why am I suddenly not able to, able to think of many names of species of birds? Crows, there we go. Crows and ravens and other corvids, you're, you're okay. Um... But not hawks, though. You guys are mean. Or eagles. You didn't take those guys all the way to Mordor, like... Fuck's wrong with you? You could've... Could've shortened that series of three movies into one movie. You just took the guys to Mordor. Yeah. Fucking eagles. So I hope, I hope blebs are well, I hope chat is well, I hope, um, people watching on the YouTubes are well. It's, it's been a weird week, hasn't it, folks? Let's be honest, it's been a funny week. But now it is time, on a new week, you know it's like a day old already, don't worry about it, to play some Mince Raft. Hold up. There we go. <laughs> it's like, why isn't it appearing? There we oh, oh god, hang on there. Oh wait, no, that's exactly where I wanted to be, right? Yeah, because I got my overlay. I, I put this here on purpose, I, I, I remember now. Pepperidge Farm remembers. So we're back in Blocker Land. With our eh. Our little eh, lad. God, I, I swear I remember that I was going to do something today with all this. And I've forgotten exactly what that is. But, oh, hello there, sir. Um. I'm just gonna put these lot here. Maybe I should be building like a tree scaffold system uh, for when I plant trees, so then I can like go to the tops of the trees instead in case of pocket trees. An anti- Thanks, Tree. Uh, an anti apocatry defense system. You know, because apocatries are like- A honk! Hello, Terry! Welcome to the Goose Land. Welcome to Blocker Land again. I hope you're all well. I hope the Noodle and her Noodle Babbies are very well. They are adorable. I have seen the Noodles. Thank you for your honey high. So, ow. Yeah, I still want to get more of those lanterns, I think. <clears throat> Just to get that all sorted out and make the village look a bit better. Oh, I should also probably make a shovel just to make the path a bit nicer around the, the village, because there's some, like, spots where the path isn't generated properly, maybe? I know, it's like... It's not an important thing to do, but it's kind of like a quality of life thing, I guess. I don't know, I'm not I'm no speedrunner. Yeah, I'm doing a really big now. Oh, bless. <laughs> Children are slept. Okie dokie, Terry. Oh, you gotta clean the oven. Oh, rip. I know that feels fucking annoying as oven. It's getting close to 50. Oh. Yeah, I am getting close to 50. Yeah, I don't know what you meant for a second. Yeah, I am getting close almost at 50 uh, followers. I meant it's like I gotta get people interacting in chat at the same time. Gotta have people chatting at the same time. Did I add that on BTTV yet? I don't remember. Uh, and I've got to do, like, a bunch of streams in, like, a month? Got oven cleaner on at the moment. Yeah, you got to, like, what, let it soak and then really scrub the fucker to oblivion. Ovens, man. Why, why can't we just not get- Who, Why haven't we invented a self-cleaning oven yet? It seems like- it seems like a really obvious thing. Anyway, I am glad you are doing at least relatively well. That is a good
This news makes the goose the happy goose. Oh my god, wow, I think this tree system I have here is doing really well, actually. Like, every time I turn around, there's a tree growing. <clears throat> oh shit. Why am I on the floor? Ah! Damn it, tree! Yeah, four hours. The last one has been in the flats in the build. I'm just tired. Yeah. I'm dreading the day I'll have to clean out my oven. I'm like, ooh, god. How many woods do we have now? Why did I? Why did I make a golem noise? So we have a stack and a bit of wood. Fuck. Like, we're kind of just waiting on our lads to like restock their inventory at the moment. That's like my major roadblock. See things like this, I may, what I may need to do is I may need to actually break this. Let that flow into there, because you can't just shovel dirt, you have to shovel grass into path, which is really fucking stupid, to be honest. Um, we're also gonna probably move this. Or, yeah, I guess, completely move it, because it's, like, in the way. Danny is lurking. Hello, Danny! Peepers, we s Danny detected. You cannot outlurk a goose. Or I guess you can. I mean, geese aren't very renowned for their ability to lurk. Oh yeah, that's another thing. I've got all that sugar cane as well to do. So, hello, hello. How are you doing, Danny? I hope all is well. Now I have to remember which chest has which fucking things in it. Oh my good days. There's some cobble to go in there. Um... Why did I put the rest of the fences? I, I know I have spare fences, right? Or do they just move them somewhere else? I feel like that's something I would do, just push something somewhere else. I'm cleaning cooking, so lurking while I can. Why well, everyone's cleaning and cooking today, and I, I feel bad, so I went, and get, I went and got a cheap kebab, because I couldn't be bothered to cook lunch. Buzzer just gone, so Gav could stream. Okay, dokie, Terry, have a good rest of your day. Obsidian. Boopy. Um, what am I doing? A good question. Hello, Mushi. I will also one day make a Terry leave and a Terry arrive. A Terry arrive is probably not that difficult, actually. Or at least a ferret arrive. I hope you are well, Mushi. How is how is things? I think we'll put at least like, I guess we'll have like one or two trees in the middle of the village at a time, maybe. Just doing a work. Ah, oh, fair enough. Hey, watching a stream while doing a work is a very good thing. I guess keeping something on in the background helps with the making it less boring or less annoying. I know that feels. Yep, yep, yep. I need items from you bastards. Mushi, yep, yep, yep. Where is a Mushi? I can give them flint for emeralds. You know what I might do? I might go on into the fucking wet I mean, uh, hole. I didn't say that. You didn't hear me say that. I, I might go into the hole and um, just excavate a bunch of gravel because I know there's gravel in places. Um, and just get a bunch of flint together. Okay, but first I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to produce a bunch of paper for our ombudsman. Ombudsman? Ombudsman? No. Yep. No, 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 I didn't say that. 
Well, I guess what I could do is I could move move some of these beds, right? Because if it's beds that is the issue, if it's the fact they can't go veg, I, I will bring the veg to them? Question mark? Could I just take the veg to them? I feel like I could, right? I guess I should be really taking bed beds from the other village rather than this one, but it's fine, right? Also, I have completely forgotten how to live with green. Is it just like two beds near each other or something? Should I be concerned? Okay. Okay, this is gonna be annoying to do. Oh, I just realized if there's just fence here. Oh, I guess I could put it under, right? I could put it under. Oh, beans. Oh, I forgot to shit. No, I didn't forget to shit. Ignore me. Have to, oh, see, if I... Wait, axes don't do that thing, do they, that other things do? Oh, hold on. I have an idea to... Do, oh, fuck, now I'm stuck in here. Shit! No, wait. Fine, I guess I'll just do this. You cannot leave. You cannot people leave, Rupers. Hopefully that might solve the issue. Oh, what am I trying to make? I'm just trying to get these villagers to restock their trades. I don't know if it's just like a timer-based thing or they have to be able to go to bed, maybe? But I know you can also refresh villager trades um, by brain, come on. By trading other things with them and sometimes trading restores other trades. So you can kind of wiggle walk all that about and get trades going that way because trading sticks with villagers is just broken as fruity is currently doing at the moment with uh there are underground only run yeah i'm glad to hear that you're okay by the way danny that these are good why aren't you is it maybe that you can't bench Okay, I'm just gonna go get some emeralds then from the other guy. Where did I put him though? I think I put him back here, right? No wait, they, no wait, he's over here because there's a house with no door. God, I have so much sugar cane at the moment. This is good. This is exactly why I plant planted all of the sugar cane. Planted chatting. Oh shit, he's offering... Oh, nice. Nice. So now I just, um... I'm not even gonna trade with him for that this time. I'm just gonna get a bunch of other stuff from the from these guys and hope that their trade refreshes. Come on, you bastard. You gunt! Fuck's sake. I tried to expose that guy for nothing. Okay. New plan. I'm gonna make a shovel out of some deep slate. Uh, fuck, I should also probably make... I probably need a storage spot, right, for all of this fucking crap. Um, yeah, definitely the new storage place. Or at least a new chest up. Um, is this a... No, that leads directly outside. That is annoying. Okay. So does chat have any, uh, any plans for the week? Chatting? Not a... I'm give you I'm gonna stick all these extra sticks in here for now. And the porky choppy boys. And I guess the extra stuff there. And extra dirt. Okay, we're gonna head down and go to the hole. So we're gonna find some gravel to just dig up. This is a very long, deep tunnel. 
It almost looks like a sideways on minecart like rail track if you look in the look right. Oh god. Okay, we do have to some torch that I can now use at least, so I can. Going out once I finally test negative. Fair enough. How are you holding up, by the way? Are you feeling any better today? Uh, English has a Oh, bless. Yeah, I'm doing good. Uh, I am going to a meeting Friday. It's my usual um, month. Uh, fortnightly meeting with my coach. Then um, I have food cycle, which is not the charity thing that I volunteer for. Oh bless you, that's good to hear. Um, and then uh, that's on Saturday. Uh, that place sort of north of me, but not too far. It's literally just washing up, but it's cool. It's like it's kind of like uh, um, I, I describe it as a soup kitchen, it's not a soup kitchen. It, they get a bunch of surplus food in from, I think, mostly supermarkets, but other places too. And they cook and serve that up and give a bunch of stuff to people uh, to use. So it's kind of a goodwill, but not really kind of thing, because they don't ask questions. It's not one of those, like, you know, you have to be homeless, you have to be destitute. It's like, hey, this is extra stuff, do you want some? Uh, so I'm doing that Saturday and also Monday. And then Sunday I'm at a concert, but not like a traditional concert, it's like an orchestral concert with a very, a very close friend of mine, should we say. So yeah, kind of a full week. And for the rest of the week I am planning to do a lot of streams. So tomorrow is probably going to be more Master Duel. Um, because there's a new event on, I want to try it out and probably cry a bit because I'm playing PvP. And I do want to do another inscription stream, and I've still got to stream the game that Eldhull gave me and figure out how the fuck to censor that, uh, because it is kind of a risque game, uh, risque being a fucking understatement. But I made a promise that I would play the game on s the, the, the JPG they gave me on stream. Uh, however, I promise, I made a promise to someone who is clearly uh, of the Fey persuasion, and yeah, I got tricked by the Fey, basically. So. I, but I've got to find. I, I I want to find a way to make that work. Because I will make this work, and it will make. I'll make this wholesome, and that'll be streamed one of the days. Maybe not this week, but it'll definitely be streamed. Anyway, uh, everyone be on creeper watch, okay? I don't want to get clapped by any creeper. Oh fuck! I don't want to get clapped by a creeper. Yeah, it's pretty busy, but I, I like having a busy week. It, it, it means that I'm not just sitting down doing nothing. Uh, I probably will also do a few YouTube videos this week. Um, probably Lego related stuff since I have a few sets on their way from donors, from friends and stuff. And one thing I won very cheap on eBay, which I'll probably sell on. Stuff like that. Do some buying and selling and stuff, that's what I do with my time. Just to get a little bit of extra payroll in an innocent way. Anyway, that bit's a bit safer now. You watch, it'll probably be dark when I get up there again. We have two stacks of gravel and 13 what's it and flim slam. Um, Flint? Yes. I should have probably built more than one shovel, to be fair, but I didn't think. Whoa, what the fuck? Sir? Can I, can I hit you? Um. <laughs> Poco! Poco, gravel. Yep, yep, yep. Mad. I don't mind gravel because gravel is going to make me some emeralds or possibly at least get me to refresh the trades on this Fletcherous, which in a way makes me emeralds because it means that if I can refresh the trades, it means that I can get those lads to actually be able to trade with me again. And shit, yeah. And stuff and things. Okay. We got some garrots. Mm -hmm. 
Garibaldi. Ah. Shing! Stab. Oh, I'm gonna fucking stab the tree! Oh! Fucking get this wood! Yeah, shove wood. Shove wood in fucking fuck it. Oh, I went. Did that. Fuck! Um, fine, I guess. Wait. I guess I could just do this. There we go. Fixed it. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. It's fine. Did not pull a complete papaya. It's fine. You did not say that. Nope, 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 nope. I keep forgetting the axes do that. Can I, like, turn this into flint at all? No, that's why the villagers are this way. Um. Okay, let's just make sure. Okay, we have four here. I'm gonna just make a couple of shovels, I guess. You know, just make a bunch of shovels. Okay, there might have been too many shovels. Uh, may have been one too many shovels. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. That's, that's, that's too many shovels. That's, that's, that's too many shovels. Well, I cannot say that I'm going into this underprepared, at least. Okay, right. Oh, you can shovel. Oh, you can do that with dirt now. I guess they changed it. Because it was fucking annoying. There we go. Just... Nope. Okay, for fuck's sake. I have to get rid of this as well, because this is annoying. Oh, fuck! Sir! Do not do that. Do not do a sneak up on the goose. Meanless Mrs. and Lil just got back, so I've got to head off and I have a great stream of favorite. Oh, I'm your favorite. Oh, bless you. Thank you. Also, oh, thank you for joining the stream. You are a good fre uh, per the friend chat person chatting. Catch you soon, yes, 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 catch you soon, Danny. Thank you for joining. Hello, Yoran. What I'm gonna do is gonna sort of do all but that one. There we go. That looks nice, right? Cap actually looks kind of cohesive now. The fuck are you doing in my bed? Do I not have ooh? I thought I had ooh. Hang on a minute. Did I not put ooh in? Oh my god. No. Nope. nope. I did not. Ha I did not put an ooh. I am. I am stupid. I can't believe I didn't put an ooh. Uh, I'll have to change up my BCV emotes, I guess, and change some stuff for ooh. It's a shame there isn't a ghost. Okay. Okay, have, have you bedged yet? No. Hold your bed. What's always there? I can't remember. If that horse just randomly appeared, that's gonna be that's terrifying. Okay. Looks like I'm gonna just have to make do with I'm gonna have to try and fix these guys and figure out Ugh. Maybe I just let them go about their devices now that they're Fletchers. But I kinda wanna well, I, I guess if I keep them to their head, right? Hmm. Wait, I have a few extra fences, so I could maybe expand their pen a little. That would help. I've got to make very sure and careful that I don't break. Okay, at least one of you should be able to go Beb now, right? Right? Beb? Yes? No? No puzz? Okay. Cowpillars. Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, how did 
this horse get in here? That's what I want to know. Mr. Piku, why? I like how there's just iron golem in here. A captive iron golem. Okay, well that's that bit done. Oh. There we go. Ooh, I can plant this. I say plant, I mean place in here. Okay, back to the grind then. So you have a bunch more sugar carne. Bunch more apples. Okay. Oh, I got a. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Use the log. The tree has grown. I may have to get an, an, another axe, maybe, to chop, chop her that down. Okay. So, give me two of your finest emeralds. And I'm gonna then go and get. Hopefully, just do some rampant trading with this shit. Okay, sir, I need you to convert some flint for me. Did that work? Did you do anything, sir? Oh, okay. Yes, I know I just traded a bunch of emeralds to essentially plus zero. Okay, he's also now gonna be able to trade me string for an emerald, which is cool. And he has just leveled up. Why can't I give your stick? Maybe, maybe they have to be able to access this? Possibly? Yeesh. Do they have to be able to like physically touch this to restock or something? How does villager restocking work? Could someone please tell me? I don't know. How to get villager to restock? <laughs> I'm confused. I should at least give me another emerald from that guy, from the uh, the farmer. Because on the one hand, I want to put the Fletcher table in with the Fletchers. On the other hand, I don't, because if I do that, then they have a way of escaping. And I ca they cannot leave. They are not allowed to people leave. Only the Goose is allowed to people leave. Okay. <sighs> Delicious babies. Not spawn. Not sponsored by Bepis, no, because... But I wish I was! Hey, Bepis! Bepis, man, if you're listening, uh, I would love you to shower me in your cold, sweet, sticky Bepis. Wait. <laughs> um, I would like to enjoy the refreshing taste of a Bepsy. Way, right? And up here. God, there are so many things about Minecraft I have yet to understand. This sounds like a philosophical question, it's really not. It's just, I haven't played this game for years. I mean, I, I guess I've been playing it kind of, sort of, without getting to grip with some of the new stuff. Fun fact, Pepsi once had. Yeah, I, I saw, so I heard. Uh, Pepsi had the. Because, what was it, in the wake of the Second World War, Germany had a bunch of, like, surplus stuff. Um... And they were also broke. And they wanted Bepis! And they weren't allowed to sell any of their military-grade stuff. But technically, PepsiCo could. So they just wound up buying or trading for all of that lovely military stuff with Germany. 
to get all that stuff, right? And, um... And yeah, they went with the sixth largest fucking army, or at least in terms of just pure weaponry and materials, in the world. Also, a fucking private island or something. I think they bought or something like that. Yeah, you know, PepsiCo's wild. Russia. Oh, it was Russia during the collapse of the U- Okay, same people, uh, sorry, same company, different, uh, military, I guess. <laughs> See, this is why geese don't, uh, teach his, uh, history at university, you know. We, we often get our ganders in a twist and our beaks in a muddle. Not to say that geese are bad animals, or bad historians for that matter, it's just we often get confused. <laughs> How are we doing off to like 29? Yeah, there's a lot of fucking dirt down here too. Speaking of dirt uh, and dirt farming, I geese are historically bad. No, yeah, historically bad animals. Yeah, we're not good with history. Um, speaking of dirt and dirt farmers, I watched. After the Toy Fair on Sunday, that was the thing I did, I went to watch, uh... What was it? Brain? Um, ooh! Tapas. Uh, I went to watch Ghostbusters Afterlife. Not the cinema, it's not on the cinema anymore, but... My dad rented it on uh, Sky Store. Again, not Spawn, but I wish I was. Um... And we watched that. My dad, I think, wasn't too over-key on it. I think he was probably thought it wasn't as good as the other Ghostbusters films, which I guess is legitimate. The dirt is <laughs> big. God damn it, you're. Uh, but yeah, I watched Ghostbusters Afterlife, which was I honestly I thought it was amazing. Uh, I think the main character Phoebe is adorable, bless her soul. Uh, it was cool seeing Dan Aykroyd. Um. It was, and it was fun seeing the old members of the cast. I won't, like, go into spoilers, but, you know, it was, it was definitely a really good movie, and I do recommend it if you're a fan of Ghostbusters. That's the hope, Mushi, that's the hope. Uh, news update, I'm officially out of torches again, so uh, let's hope no monsters come up and clap my back so like it's my booty like it's the 4th of July. Don't know why I picked the 4th of July specifically, but you know. I'm kind of just going to go into my inventory floor, I think, for this. This is how, this is like a, this now just turned into like 1950s miner simulator. Where you have to mine gravel for fucking people's paths, like. Thank you, I want to go to paths! Fucking entitled upper class, middle upper classmen mining gravel paths for a driveway. Or because they think it looks cool. Or because they want weird shaped stones with a crazy paving and. I don't know why I'm going with this. Fourth of July weird. Yep, 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 yep. Fourth of July is very weird. Uh, I can hear a zombie. Oh, he might be coming from over there. Oh, oh, there's a hole. I have found a hole. Which is kind of scary, honestly, because that means things can come through that hole. Eh, what's up there? You know what? You know, he's gonna do this. Just gonna, just gonna steal that for a minute. We're gonna deal with that later. I'm gonna go mine some gravel someplace else. Who celebrates American Independence Day, apparently? Look, the day the Americans fucked off was a great day for everyone in England. Don't add at this. No, I'm kidding. I actually. 
despite, I guess, being from the sovereign land of the United Kingdom. I, I, I don't, while I don't celebrate it, I, ex I respect it, like, if you know, like, why America seceded, essentially. Be pretty much because they were trying to get taxed without representation, that's the whole thing. And being taxed without being represented in Parliament is pretty fucked, to be honest. And the idea that, oh, you know, you're still a sovereign nation, you, you know, you're not, you don't get your fucking freedom. Like, thanks. You, the whole fucking reason the, the pilgrims went to America was to escape shit like taxation in the church. And what does taxation in the church do? Knocks on their fucking door like, like they're the IRS in modern times and be like, yo, where's my fucking money? So I, I totally get it, you know. Someone in the comments is, or uh, in the chat is going to com completely obliterate my understanding of uh, American independence and why it happened. Uh, because, as we all know, geese are historically bad at history. Um, it's any consolation, it still feels like that thanks to the magical power of gerrymandering. It's true! It's true! Ah, uh, Sag. But at least you're being ruled uh, by people from the same nation rather than people literally across an entire fucking ocean away, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Meanwhile, 95% of the nations once controlled by the British Empire are like just tapping their feet like, Yeah! Must be fun having sovereignty of your, of your own fucking nation! Yeah. Politics is fun. Um, geese are also not very good at politics because we just fight. Geese are like orcs, actually, you know. They're, they're more interested in the concept of fighting than the concept of peace. And the idea of a democracy is quite peaceful, so... Croatia, don't, yeah, pretty much. That's the same everywhere, though, you know. Late stage capitalism and all that. That's on the top of the greatest country in the world and showed up. Hello, snack! Speaking of... Speaking of freedom-loving people... This is sarcasm. Yep, yep, yep. I don't like to talk about politics makes me sad. Yeah, same. I like to mock politics, though. Like I'm some sort of, you know, comedian in my mid-30s at the O2 arena. Because, eh. Polit politics is, I guess, topical and everyone can kind of, not vibe with it, but everyone can, um, not sympathize. What's the word? The fuck is the word? Uh, oh. Fuck, I don't know what the word is. Empathize? No, it's not empathy. It's... Maybe you're a comedian in your <laughs> mid-30s, we don't know. Oh, I hope I'm not in my mid-30s. Yeesh. That would mean I'm... Can geese do stand-up comedy? Uh, well, kind of, but we usually are sat down during, so I guess not. Complain? Yeah, yeah. Resonate. Uh, that's what I was gonna say. They, you can resonate with that kind of thing because it's topical, and you. Everyone is affected by politics, right? P pretty much everyone. Even people are even being affected by politics in other countries, especially of recent. Um, mostly because you know, uh, locally we've had uh, recently had uh, the, the big pond elections, and uh, Gubert Gooserton uh, is kind of leading in the polls as usual, as expected. And, uh, yeah, his manifesto was pretty large. It, uh, and by which I, I, I mean that he put the word honk 4,895 times, and no goose has ever done that before, turns out, in the history of, uh, in the history of goose political uh, things. Of course, the elections actually mean nothing, but, you know, geese pond is a good important. We're not like electing like a president or anything uh, of the pond. We're, we're electing a commander for the army. Yeah, so we actually democratically elect our our commanders, not our political people, because geese are actually living in a in a sort of habit of dictatorship, which is fine, uh, uh, because I am their leader, I am their ruler, but I am firm yet fair, and I'm a good goose. 
know where, I don't I don't know where I'm going with this. I really do not know where I'm going with this. Big honking str Hello, George! Uh, Mr. Pants has arrived, everybody. Anybody say a big honking hello to Mr. Pants? I can trade some carrots as well now, I think. Oh shit. Um yeah, I'll we'll just get rid of the cop deep, deep, deep slate for now. How is the George doing? How is the Mr. Pants doing? Also, how is how is this neck? How is this neck doing? Okay, we now have plenty of flint, we now have plenty of cobbly bob, we now have plenty we have plenty of a lot of things actually, so. We should be able to get some filthy, uh, uh, fantastic trades going. Filthy trades? Yep. Yep, filthy trades. So, I would like to give you these carrots. Thank you, sir. And I would like to give you lots of stick for not having sticks, if I may. Are you going to let me have stick, try sticks with you now? No, you are not, because you're a gunt. What about you? Yes! Da -da 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 -da. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're just gonna do the trade thing. Just to get him leveled up. There we go. Plus we also have, just have a shitload of gravel. So The pants are good, full of filthy burgers and mozzarella sticks. Ooh, filthy burgers. What's your filthy burger then, mate? What's your filthy burger? Snack is seeking decent signal. People part. Hope you find a decent signal soon, friend. So, um... Shit, I'm fucking out of inventory space again in this fucking thing. <laughs> Just stick some of that in there for now. Do we have a spot for... for me? Okay, um... A bunch of pumpkins. Uh, so what I'll do, I'll make, like, so many pumpkin seeds, and then we'll trade the rest of the pumpkins. So I'll make a bunch of pumpkin seeds, stick those in there. I will make a pumpkin farm, because this guy... That guy over there wants pumpkins, and once we get mending on an axe, uh, or something like that... I guess, no, yeah, pump, pumpkins are great for trading, honestly. Pumpkins are great to trade. Because they grow at kind of the same rate as other things, and you, uh, you need less of them to do trades with. Those aren't goose noises. I don't know what's happening. I think I turned into a motorbike for a second. Um, you could also trade for melon, which would be great if we had melons and a silk touch uh, axe, but we don't. We can also get cookies now, which is poggies. Oh yeah, I need to get those sticks, right? I need to go grab those sticks. From the river sticks, no less. Oh, we got loads over here. Holy shit. Did you hear about the schoolboy who uh, ate too much candy in class? Yeah, he got sugar caned. It's a terrible joke, I'm sorry. What you doing, man? Oh, you're the weaponsmith. Wait, we can get bells? Guys, we can get fucking bells on this guy, I forgot. Anyway, uh, wait, hang on a minute. Three for an iron axe. We do need a new axe. And I don't want to get iron, so I'm gonna get an axe from this guy. I'm gonna axe him a question. Corporal punishment! Yeah, Saj. <laughs> 36 emeralds, though, that's expensive. It's worth it for a penny, grommet! I'm probably deep throwing my microphone, then I'm sorry. Um, there we go, now I can put away some of this. Put away the game! Yep, 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 put away the game. There we go. That should be enough sticks, I think, for now. To trade with this guy. My rules! Yeet! 
I'm a dolphin, motherfucker! Yo, Mr. Pat, Mr. I almost. Okay, this guy here, this this guy, yeah, this guy, he's gonna be called Mr. Pants now. Purely because I accidentally called him Mr. Pants, just. You are Mr. Pants now. As soon as I get a name tag, you can get renamed. No, it's not optional. Oh, look at all those fucking. So you say, you say 36 emeralds is expensive. But now I'm up to 20. Like, already. Okay, so maybe it is a bedge thing, right? Maybe it is a bedge thing. It was just that they couldn't bedge before, maybe? Maybe they could not bedge? Snack back to work. Okay, okay, Snack, enjoy your work. Uh, see you again in the not too distant future. Yep, yep, yep. I'm only going to take the carrots for now. Wait, actually, I think I'll take the wheat too, because I can maybe use the seed, the extra seed, to um, plant more. Or increase the growth of some carrots, maybe? Oh, wait, hang on. This is a. Are you a carrot? You are a carrot. Sounds like the start of a weird commercial. Are you a carrot? Have you been involved in in a blending incident that wasn't your fault? Call carrot lawyers for you today to receive zero percent compensation. Ah, uh, my name is Daniel. I was involved in a carrot accident. Yeah. My owner put me in a blender, and now I'm shredded. I got no comp. I got zero pounds and zero pence compensation. Fuck. Ah. Uh, yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, do we just want to get a bunch? Of yeah, I think we want to just get a bunch of lanterns, right? Oh, look at that sound. Look at that sound. Yep. Look at that sound. Look at that sound, Gromit. Uh, Ooh, oh, channeling. Isn't that for... That's for tridents, right? You... Gunt. No, it's fine, it's fine. I'm not pissed, I'm not annoyed, it's fine. Everything's okay, everything's fine. Everything's fine. Sound? <laughs> yeah, peep is at the sound. Yeah, maybe we'll look at that sound. Oh my gosh. <sighs> yeah, channel for Trident. Is it good channeling or is it like the worst? I feel like it's the worst, right? That's what my hunch says. Who's <laughs> you calling a gunt? <laughs> Sorry, Yoran, please don't people leave. Make some food. Yeah, replacement food. Hopefully the other guy will sleep now and get his sticks reva revoked, I mean revamped, I mean restored. Yeah, I think Riptide is better. What what does Riptide and Channeling do then? I don't know what it does. But yeah, you're probably right. All loyalty. Yeah, it's a shame you can't put loyalty on a hoe though. I mean, not that you'd need to, but you know what I mean. Lo I think loyalty is the best thing for a trident, but I don't even have a trident, and trident is like really hard to get a hold of, so it's like, what the fuck is the point? Okay, 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 okay. Riptide makes you fly when wet. I mean, I fly when wet anyway. I'm always flying when I'm wet. It's my secret, I'm always wet. <laughs> it comes with the territory of being a goose. Okay, ch if channeling makes lightning, then that's kind of cool. Because I guess you could do certain things with that. Like, if you really wanted to make a charged creeper, you could. Or make zombie pigmen out of pigs, I guess you could. Hold up. Don't zombie pigmen occasionally drop gold stuff when you hit them with something with looting? What if 
I made a pig farm with like a, a detachable segment to lure some pigs through, to hit them with lion, turn them into zombie pigmen, to, to then farm them. Is that a legit strategy? Or is that like a waste of uh, a trident using channeling? Oh, this is a fucking apocatry! God damn it! I think there are easier pigman farms, and I think you're absolutely right. But I'm a dumbass, and I'm like, yo, is that a funny idea? And the answer is yes. But yeah, you're probably almost definitely right. Oh my god, this is the most annoying tree house ever, and I didn't even intend to make it. Oh my god. Accidental tree house. This is why I hate trees. Well, oak trees, I guess, specifically. I should have made that pocket tree defense system. Oh god, there's even more than one pocket tree over here, right? Nope, maybe not. I'm just gonna get as much of this stuff as I can. Oh good lord. Shit. Yep, there's an pocket tree. Oh my god, there's multiple pocket trees in this fucking place. I'm getting apples though, that's good. I may have to get out the flint and steel and just torch the rest of this. Just to make sure that it fucking all goes away. There's just something not very neat about a pocket tree, you know. Hold up, maybe I can climb to the top of this tree. Or series of trees. Bad goose, no lighting fires. <laughs> Look, if I want to set the world on fire, I I will. Not that I want to set the world on fire. I just want to start a flame in your heart, Yoran. What if something goes wrong? I mean, that's for God to to figure that one out. I guess. You know. That's for Zeus, I guess. Not Zeus, Poseidon. Because there's tridents, I guess Poseidon exists in this universe or something. I don't think I have one of those. Aww, Yoran. <laughs> Yoran just has a pacemaker confirmed. Either that or Yoran is like, I don't know, a, a synth or a robot or something. I'm a fucking dumbass. You know what? I'm just gonna grab all of this wood. be done with it, I guess. And then we'll go from there with the rest of the trees and whatnot. Oh, shit. Another fucking tree just grew. Yep. Holy shit, there's so many fucking trees. There's so much wood in this bitch. Uh, bish. Uh, thing. Yeah, there's lots of wood here. But can I see the forest for the, 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 the wood? No, no I can't. Hang on. How, how are we doing on this front? Okay, there's... So many fucking trees to mine. Hopefully now it should start like tearing itself apart. The the wood, I mean. I 
I hope this thing just leaves. I'm gonna plant a bunch of these saplings somewhere else, I think. Out of the way. Oh my god, there's a fucking... Mother... Oh, really? Are they all the way up there? Oh. Fine, I'll just do this, I guess. Uh, elven scaffolding. Yeah. Good old elven scaffolding. Another thing I'm gonna do is grab all the flowers from here to compost them. Except the corn flower, of course. There we go. Oh, an apple. Apple run. Ooh, looks like some character growing, which means I can maybe trade up for another boy. Lovely. Do not fall in the ocean, please. Um, no, that was good. Is this all carrot? I think it is. Yeah. I made this all carrot, right? I think. Placing the saplings that close together is why you get massive clear trees that are not clear. Wait, really? God, I thought I was just being efficient. Does it, like, make it more likely that a pocket tree occurs? Because I thought that was only, like, uh, dark oak saplings where you have to place four next to each other and it does a thing. Like, I know you have to do that to even plant dark oaks, right? Okay, boiks. Are you ready to give me some emeralds? No? no? Fuckers. You can give me an emerald though, right? Yes, you can. Oh, also, we'll start placing some of these lanterns in places again. So this place has lanterns, this building has lanterns, right? Can have all its lanterns? Yeah, looks like it. This building can have all its lanterns. Lantern? Lantern. Uh, we'll get rid of the torch, because we can actually use those. Um... Lantern. Well, it's like when there's a tall blocker, blocker next to a sapling, the sapling has to... Oh, yeah, it's a good point. Shit, I didn't think of that. This is why my blocker is big and only does one thing. Grow pocket trees. I guess I'll have to, like, make an artificial forest instead or something. Photosynthesis, yep. <laughs> Meanwhile, Viva Pinata. A uh, plant is stunted. Plant is stunted. Plant is stunted. Shut the fuck up, plant! I'll stunt you in a minute. This building has lots of lanterns. I mean, lots of torches so that we can sack salvage. Just use birch trees, they don't go giant. Yeah, I haven't seen any birch trees of yet, though. I have not seen the resting birch face. I say as I plant another oak tree. I, I wouldn't even mind if the town, 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 town center... Ah, uh, bleh. You could deliberately go dark oak and spruce and go deliberately big tree. True. True, I could go deliberately big tree. I mean, spruce big tree is not annoying. Neither is dark oak big tree, because at least dark oak big tree is for also a wide boy. Which makes them kind of easier to deal with as well. Right, I 
Okay, that should. Oh. Carota? Okay, so. Um, right. I'm gonna do one last honey check at the, uh. The lads over here. And if they're not trading with me today, then I'm a fucking kill. No, I'm joking. I will do a co uh, do a block out down in the hole. I I'm a actually no, I'm gonna do an explorer. I'm gonna do an explorer. We're gonna chart our surroundings a little bit. For a second I thought he escaped. For a hot minute I was like, he's gone. Okay. Um, so I could get the Book of Channeling if I really wanted to. I think they need more beds. Mm, really? They need more bed? Sharpness 5. I could also get it at some point. But I want to upgrade him to Master. Fuck. No, nope, fine. I'll just get some glasses while. Glass is also useful for things. Okay, you are now a Master, which means... No, you're not. Why are you not a Master? Did you really need, like, a little more XP? Wait. Yeah, six emeralds for looting through, which is amazing, honestly. Okay. We can now get name tags, at least, so I can now name people if I really want to. That was kind of the main reason I wanted to get them to, to master. Uh, I guess now we have to hunt down... We have to fuck a, a place, another villager somewhere, to get him to do stuff. Realistically, I should have built, like, the Library of Alexandria and just done things the proper way. Right. So. Into that, into that. Put stuff into here for now. As much as I can. Um, I'm going to place some lanterns. Hmm. I'm not sure I'd place them on the church, actually. another house sort of upgraded, I guess. This one gets, I guess, more than four because it's weirdly angled. There we go. And then... That only needs one more, but beyond that it's fine. I think we'll head up over this hillock today and see what's happening. Yo, is that? Oh, no, that's just the illager sign I put up there earlier. I thought maybe there was another raid or a skeleton had spawned or something. I have a bucket on me? I do. I have my emergency bucket in case I see another raid or something or another. A uh, 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 group of lads out on patrol, ready to fight me and give me the debuff, which means I can't go home. But then I just drink milk and everything's fine. So what is over this hill? What's that coming over the hill? Is it a goose? Is it a goose? It's a goose. <laughs> Yeah, hey, thank you, Gunt. I remember when mutton was a modded thing. It was like, yo, now it's vanilla. Although I think vanilla mutton would taste weird, personally. Okay, there is a cave down here. Let's have a look. Is there anything tasty in this cave? I mean, other than gravel. I mean, there's cobble, 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 cobble. Oh, there is a fucking. Oh. Oh, there's a lot in here, actually. Holy shit. Welcome. Welcome to the chat room! We got phone games! What's up here? Boy, am I glad I had all of those torches I saved up. Okay, this is a nice cave, actually. This is a nice cave -er. Okay, let's go get that copper, then. Not copper, uh... 
coal to trade with that guy, right? To trade with our weaponsmith. Because not only will I get emeralds, and I can both of those. Yeah. Uh, old? Johnny old? <laughs> Feels old, man. But yeah, we're gonna trade with him, because not only that gives us, again, more emeralds, we'll also level him up. Which means we might be able to get some diamond weapons from him. And getting diamond grade stuff without having to, you know, use diamonds is good. I have a, a kind of almost obsession with things being renewable uh, in Minecraft. I, I like to get my items through renewable sources. And I say as I dig up coal. Like, really valuable and rare things like diamonds, I'd like, I'd like to try and be renewable with them. And I'm only doing this, like, not to renewable strat purely because I'm trying to accelerate things. And it's also early game, so I can't renewable a lot of stuff. I only think no, because it played you in the uh, Cockneys versus Zo What the fuck is Cockneys versus Zombies? That sounds amazing, you are at. That sounds hilarious. It's a Thanks, Joran. I, I kind of figured it was a movie. I'm, I'm, I'm guessing the present, the, the premise is just Cockneys versus Zombies. I'm guessing. It's a fairly explanatory title. Uh, is it a good movie? Probably one of my favorite zombie movies. Nice. It's like one of those very cheesy B movies. It's just really dumb and more funny than anything else. Or is it like, was it like trying to be funny and it actually works. You know, like how Scream... Scream is a horror movie, but it's also just funny. Wait, no, Scary Movie. Scary... I mean, Scream is also funny, but Scary Movie is the one I was thinking of. No. <laughs> no. Is it a good movie? Just no. Giggle. Okay, we have a bunch of cobber, cobber now. I don't know. <laughs> it was trying to do something. Uh, no one knows what it was trying to do, though. It may have been deliberately bad, I'm not sure. Hey, deliberately bad is the best kind of bad. I aspire to be deliberately bad, you know? Ow, my bones. Is that an extreme hills biome, or is it, or is it happy to see me? I don't know. Wait. Uh, I, I mean, um, uh, I mean, is it just, is it just a really ambitious hill is what I mean? You know, could just be an ambitious hill. Though, uh, hill and Minecraft are w two words that no longer go together. Uh, because of a certain server I was on, where someone made a place just called Hill, and it was a lag fest. Not an intentional lag fest, but it was a lag fest. And it hurt everyone's feelings. And their brains. But nobody complained because it was made by someone really cute. So... Don't tell Drake I said that. Where's the fucking weaponsmith gone? He's gotta be around here somewhere, right? This is his building. Weaponsmith! Weaponsmith! Yo, weaponsmith, where the fuck are you? You fall down the well again? Oh, there you go. Nope, you're the toolsmith. Oh, for fuck's sake, weaponsmith. Thank you. Emerald bread. Where did the toolsmith go, actually? Fuck's sake. Fucking villagers, man. 
new piece of fucking... Okay, give me that. I want to start leveling you up as well. I'm gonna head out for now, have a good rest of your- Oh, good, okay, you're and have a very nice day. I hope you are doing- I hope your day is good and only does one thing. Sure, yeah. I'm, I know, I, I know what I'm saying. Words. Words are important. Yum, yum, yum. Okie dokie. So we know what's over the hill now, kind of. It's actually just another hill. Okay, do you guys want to trade with me yet? Hold on. <laughs> Jeez, please. No, you don't. Of course you don't. <coughs> Holy sweet Mary Magdalene, mother of gods. No nope, shit. Okay. So, I was after getting mending, right? So, I think what we'll do is we will block another guy in his house. Because I'm an asshole, mostly. I'm a horrible goose, and I do horrible goose things. So we're gonna make some... Six should maybe do it? No, because I need to do both sides, right? So I might as well just make all his sticks. Make a bunch... Because we need a bunch of these anyway for the hole. And if the traders aren't gonna trade with me... If they, they don't want to dance if they want to... And they don't... And, and they... Don't want to leave their friends behind. Then we'll dance. If they don't dance, then we'll dance, and we'll dance on their behinds, right? Yeah. Hold up. Oh, for fuck's sake! Oh, police! There were police nearby. Police just went past. If you care. Um... You're a, just a generic villager, right? Okay. Oh, I didn't, um... Do I have to like, am I gonna have to push this guy near to it? Get out of the fucking well! Get out the well! Where are you going? Where the hell are you go- Do not become a third- Oh, for goodness sake. Go to the enchantment table, thank you. Okay. Yes. Okay. No, nope. no, you are not leaving the building. Thank you. No, you are not leaving the building, sir, sir. There we go. Okay, come here. Efficiency. No. Wait, I'm going to also get rid of this shit. These don't need to be here. You're not allowed to sit down. You're allowed to bench, though. Sir, please do not... Thank you. There we go. Uh, aqua affinity. No. Power. Nope. Are you nodders at me, sir? 
Luck of the sea. Ooh. It's only luck of the sea one though, but luck of the sea one also means I can get stuff like mending, right? No, I need I need mending specifically. I could get mending from fishing, but it's like a really low chance. That was terrible. Frostwalker, no. Yeah. Looting three, we already have. 25 emeralds. Whoa! Be careful, sir! Be careful! Be careful! Please do not... Sir, this is a work zone. Stay in your corner, sir. Sweeping edge. No. That's like the worst enchantment ever. Sir, please get off the lectern. I do not want to accidentally hit you. Sir, please just... Power five. Yeesh. Good for a bow, but I don't have any arrows. Sharpness 2? No, we already have sharpness 5. So please stop moving about. Get out of the work zone, or I'm gonna fucking hit you with my sword. Channeling, we already have channeling. Quick charge. That's another thing for either the crossbow or the thing, right? Punch one for the trident. I don't care about. Feather falling three. Sir, I'm gonna feather fall on your ass in a minute if you don't stop moving. Channeling again. Sir, please stop moving. You're in the way. Feather falling one. Sir, please stop coming towards me. Fire protection. I just want mending. I just want fucking stop standing on the lectern. Curse of binding, literally fucking useless. And they worse than useless. Not even an enchantment. Not even an enchantment twice. Get off the lectern. I will stab you. Depth Strider. See, Depth Strider is good for around about here. That's where you can walk through water, right? Like, quicker. But, it's like, eh, Silk. See, Silk Touch is good. And for 12 emeralds, that's a good get off the lectern. But I need mending. Mending is what I actually need. Aqua Affinity. Sir, so please give me mending. Please learn mending. Sir, please learn mending. Please mend. No, that's not mending. God, the reroll on this is annoying. I just want mending. I just want mending. Sir, please. Please become a... Thank you. Multi-shot? What is this, a pinball game? You think this is fucking pinball, Mr. Villager? Fuck you. I need you to become a thingy. Piercing? What is this, Yu-Gi-Oh? You think this is a fucking Yu-Gi-Oh game? I'm gonna do piercing battle damage? Oh god, there is my fucking thing. Okay, villager, I need you to become a man again. Okay. I'll be back in another axe, guy. There's definitely more efficient ways of doing this, but... And neater ways as well, I guess, but like... Do I look neat and organized to you? Do I look like a neat, organized goose? There we go. Now I can get back up if I need to. this copper. Put this flint away. In this door. Sorry about the burp. Yeah, maybe. Sorry about the burping. Okay, we're just gonna make another axe and we're gonna keep at this. I want mending, sir. I require the mend.
<laughs> I like how Yoran just went live. God damn it. Yoran is competing with me. Rude. Fire aspect. Fire aspect's good, but also it's like not mending. So, can you stop? Man Sir, please stop and please be careful. Or I'm gonna hit. Stop it! I will stab you! I will stab you. Stop trying to get on the lectern. What are you doing? Why are you humping me? Why are you doing this? Stop it! Stop! Stop! I will stab you. I will. There are other villagers that I can get this from. Stop jumping at me. I'm going to wind up hitting with my axe. Fine. If you want to be in that corner, you can be in that corner. Fortune. Okay, fortune is good, but again, it's not mending. Channeling. Oh, shit. Wait, why are you looking at the corner when you could just go to sleep in this lovely bed? Look. Yeah, you got tricked then, didn't you? Unbreaking. See, unbreak... Please be careful. Unbreaking is good, but again, it's not quite mending. Looting three, we already have. Sir... I'm breaking again. I just want mending. That's multi-shot. I feel like they almost remove mending from villagers. Please be careful! I will hit you by accident! Or on purpose if you keep annoying me. Okay, luck of the C2. Punch 2. I should have gone with the fucking luck of the C, shouldn't I? Sir, please go to your post. Sir, please stop moving. Just go to a place near the thing, not on the thing, near it, and stay in place, please. Unbreaking. You know what else is unbreaking? My heart. No, actually, complete opposite. My heart is fucking breaking into several pieces. I'm so upset that he's not getting mending. Why is this taking so long to get mending? Oh my god. Frostwalker. Sir. Respiration? What do I look like? A fucking deep sea diver to you? Multi-shot? This is the third time this week you've shown multi-shot in class. Efficiency. So you are on the lectern again. Please get off the lectern. Alright, we're gonna move it over here then if you're gonna be a dick about it. Flame. I'm not- do you see a bow on my person? Okay, I have a bow on my person, but- do you see arrows? No. Not being a dick. Infin- fuck you! Channel- it's like the fifth time I've seen channeling. I just- I just want mending. I just want- You've shown me every single enchantment except for me mending. See, so efficiency four is good, but again, it's not mending, is it? Is it mending? Is it fucking mending? Step straight or three. Stop coming towards me. Just stay in place. Just stay in one spot. In one spot. Impaling? Okay, I haven't seen that before. That's a... But again, that's a... Um... Fish hook. One. Why are you not becoming a guy now? Okay. That's... What do they call it? They call it... Trident. Trident. Yeah. It's a trident enchant. Curse of Vanishing. Okay, we haven't seen that yet, but it's, again, worse than useless again. In fact, that's probably the most useless you could get. Knockback. Very useless. J 
Just give me fucking mending! Oh my god. That's not even an enchantment book, come on! This is getting ridiculous. No! That's a curse! It's not even a good enchantment! That's not even an enchantment! Are you fucking with me right now? That's twice you've shown me no enchantment in a row. Three times in a row. Four times in a row. Piercing four. No. So, knock back two. Respiration one. So, I need mending. I need mending. Can you just give me mending? Power three. That's not mending. Mending. You know what? I'm going to give you ten more attempts. If I don't get mending in those ten, I'm killing you. Projector protection four. Nine left. Give me mending or give you death. Frostwalker. Eight left. You better fucking obey me, otherwise I'm going to fucking kill you. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Do as you're told, villager. Two. Motherfucker, one. Do as you're told. You know, it didn't work. I was trying to, like, intimidate him, but it didn't work. I can't kill him after the, all the effort I've done to get this far. To put him in a house and whatnot. Like, I don't want to do that. Look, can you just give me mending? Can you just give me in the channel of mending, for fuck's sake? Unbreaking? That's not mending, is it? Is it mending? It's not mending, is it? Blast protection also is not mending. I just want you to teach me mending. Lord knows I need it, right? I just want mending. Why won't you give me mending? Is there something changed with Minecraft where you can no, now no longer get mending from villagers? Did they change that? Because it feels like they did, because I have not seen a single mending thus far. I've done this for nearly 20 fucking minutes, or however long I've been doing this for, and I've still not seen mending. And it's starting to fucking grate on me. Riptide? No. Flame? Nope. If I see a decent luck of the sea, I'm gonna take that instead. Go over there. It's efficiency. Infinity. Power. Mr. Villager, please. Oh my god, this is so annoying and probably very boring as well. But you know what? You're going to be just as bored as I am. Suffer with me, chat. Suffer with me. Suffer and boredom at me not getting fucking... Mending. Villager, why won't you give me mending? What? Why? What? What kind of sick game do you think this is, villager? Hmm? I'm asking you to give me mending. We're gonna be stuck here until you give me mending. Do you understand that? How many times must I make you dress and undress before you do as you're told? So, put your fucking clothes back on. Power 4 is not mending. Try again! Impaling is not mending. Try again! Curse of Binding is not mending. Try again. Help! 
fucking sneezing. I'm not even ill, I've just got allergies. I'm allergic to not mending. <coughs> oh, I'm sorry, chat, I'm sorry. Go over to the thing. Respiration 3 is tempting. I swear, this villager is fucking with me. Multi shot. Where's mending? Do you want me to stab you? Where's mending, villager? <laughs> yeah, I know there's a fucking iron golem right, so out, right outside. I can take him. You think I can't? You think I can't take an iron golem? I've killed like eight of them so far. You think I can't? Don't fuck with me. I need my mending. I'm not gonna stop until I get my mending. You will give me mending, or I'm gonna fucking hurt you. Emotionally, mostly. I'm gonna say very nasty things about you. And probably go and, uh... You know, fuck your wife behind your back, and things like that. You know? There are, I can make- I, I have ways of making you give me mending. You're not gonna like them. Give me mending, sir. Go to your post and give me mending. Give me the mending. I said give me mending. I'm getting to the end of my tether now, villager. <laughs> I must have done this over a hundred times and not give me mending. That is a bookshelf, villager. <laughs> I do not want bookshelves. I want a mending book. A mending book. Yeah? Fuck it, we're gonna take luck of the sea too. I will take matters into my own fucking hands and go and fish for a book of mending. Because it's more fucking likely than fucking getting it from you, isn't it? I am more likely to get a 2% fucking chance of a book from fishing than I am from you. And at least if I fish for it, I can get other shit rather than just fucked over by a fucking man with a nose bigger than the San Andreas fault. Fucking bullshit. <laughs> fucking asshole. Fucking fucking me about like that. I should not be getting so pissed off over such a simple thing, but for fuck's sake! You know, it's just ridiculous the amount of effort that I went to trying to get a mending book from that guy. He just wasn't gonna give me it, was he? How did you get up here? I mean, kudos, but how did you get up here? Wait, could I push that guy into the... No, because I've made him a... He's definitely a locked in as that class now, right? So I can't give him anything. Wait, why did you chip? Are you fucking with me right now? What the fuck? Are you kidding me? I go away for five fucking seconds and you change your trade. Are you... I'm gonna fucking kill you if you don't comply. I will do it. I will fucking do it. I am at the end of my level of patience with you. Fucking give me what I need. And do it promptly.
Bucko, I can get somebody else to do your fucking job for you. I can get somebody else to do your fucking job, Bucko. Bucko, you better buck your ideas up. I need something I can use and I need it now. Silk touch, no. Efficiency five is good, but it's not quite curling. It's not gonna help me get, it's not gonna, it's not mending, it's not gonna help me get mending. Fortune two is good, but it's not gonna help me get mending. Do you know what? I'm gonna look for another villager. If I can find another blank villager, do you know what? You're dead. Yeah, you're fucking dead. I will kill you if I can find another villager. In fact, I know exactly where I can get more villagers from. If it weren't so awkward to go and grab a villager from another village by stealing my on a boat, you know what I'd do? I would kill you. I would actually kill you. You would be dead. Do you understand the ramifications of that? Don't fuck with me. Why are you do- why are you torturing me? You're the one that's supposed to be tortured. Thank you. Jesus fucking criminy crickets. Okay, that will suffice. Luck of the sea will just fucking have to do. Where's my, um, fishing rod? There it is. I'm gonna get a book of mending, so help me fucking god, I swear. I'm going to relax with some chill fishing and see what I get. See, I don't know if I've talked about it on stream. Uh, last Saturday, Sunday, Sunday? Yeah, Sunday. I went to a toy fair, which is in the NEC, and I got a bunch of things. It was really amazing up there, actually. There were like 10 or so rows of stalls and fucking hell. Where did that bottle go? There. Um, and there was all sorts of stuff there, like old Star Wars stuff. I saw like a big plastic. A few bottle. moments later. Holy shit! What the fuck was that, sir? Oh, thank you, Sandbard. <laughs> How long have you been there? I hope you're well, Sandbard. Uh, you missed me going fucking ape shit at villagers earlier for not giving me a fucking mending book. I still didn't get one, but I got luck of the sea. So yeah, the toy fair had like 12 like rows of stalls. A bunch of like Star Wars stuff, um, there was a bunch of Transformer stuff. Um, what else was there? Old die cast, so like Dinkies, Corys and whatnot, so my dad was really happy. Um, and I got a bunch of Lego stuff from there, so I got... There'll, there'll be a video on the YouTube channel soon. Uh, showing exactly what I got, but I got a few Lego set things. I got a new car, a little like diecast scale car. Um, ooh, clownfish. I am 16 second delay. Very sad, sandbar people. Pat. My chat is also delayed. So that's funny. So sound scared. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> scared by your own sound, honey. Point. Goose point. Um, some of the coolest things I saw there were the Battle of Hoth set, Lego set. Um, it was like 160 odd quid, and that was like a massive one. 
I think it was the Battle of Hoth. It had like, you know, the... It was a large scene and whatnot. Uh, they had one of the Ninjago city sets, one of the massive ones. Uh, some old Lego space figures. I should They were like two pound each. I should have picked up the space police one. I don't think the guy knew what he had, but it was like, eh. Um, I know those are quite rare. And they were in really good condition too. And they also had a Lego space, um, I think space police two ship. I think it was 10 quid. It was only one of the smaller ones, but you know, it was still, it was in relatively good condition, had instructions, and I should have picked that one up. And there was like bags of stuff as well. I saw a bag of some stuff with some Mtron stuff in it. And again, I didn't pick that up. I was like trying to be really cautious of not spending too much in one go. As you do when you're a toy fairy, because there are 12 stalls, 12 rows of, rows of stalls, and you never know what you'll see from one stall to the next. But it was a very fun day out. I will definitely go to the next one, which I think is in May. BP Ferris one? I've got a leaflet somewhere of all the different ones. I should probably start going to those. To, to buy some things and then sell stuff. Some of the stuff that I maybe get on Facebook and whatnot. I did tell, I tell you what I did get, I did get an ultimate rare um, Elemental Hero Blade Edge. And I should have got more stuff in that cellar, but I didn't think about it. But Elemental Hero Blade Edge Ultimate Rare is really expensive. Like, I'm not sure of the exact value, because it's, um... The, the values of it kind of... I've seen 30 quid, and I've seen $200. So it's like the disparity in, in what it's worth is huge. I may have to check eBay sold listings specifically. So, so honks your shovel's looking rather busted. That's fine, I have like five more. <laughs> I have many. I have many shovels, my friend. I have a lot of shovels. And yes, my shovel is very big and does only one thing. So, so far, the only treasure we've gotten is a water bottle. What a bottle! Um, I was hoping for a book of mending. Because it's probably going to take me less time to fucking get a book of mending for this method than it is to get it from a fucking villager, I think. Which is super fucking annoying, honestly. But I did that rigmarole with a villager for a long time and didn't got anything out of it. Hmm. So I went, took the low bowl of luck of the sea too. But I couldn't be bothered to wait for more fucking. I couldn't be bothered to dance that dance anymore, you know. Because I didn't have ants in my pants. I had to sit through a comedy town hall about how... Town hall? All about how poggers it is that we're moving to green phase and more people in the office now. <laughs> Hang on, surely people, more people being in the office is less green. Because I have to commute. <laughs> I bet you're upset with that. More people in the office sounds annoying. Oh, you mean like green COVID phase, not like green. Not this blip, just give me one cent month for the team meeting. Go ski kill! Pro COVID protocols, I thought so. Yeah, I, eventually I was like, wait, hang on. I don't get why companies want more people back in the office. Surely it's better for everyone involved if people, more, if people continue to work from home. I got a tripwire hook. That's technically a treasure, I guess. Hold, you know what we're going to do? I'm going to actually build something out of this. I'm actually going to build a little something. No, not called the deep slate, actually. Where is the... Okay, I'm gonna smelt some cobble. Bard has an adult job. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> I 
I mean, that could be taken in a very different direction. Bards are used to having adult jobs, I guess. A bone! I will take that. You know what? I will take that to the bank. Because we can grow some carrots with that. That means a... I don't, yep, a bunch of carrot. Which is basically an emerald. Basically. <laughs> bonk. Do not bonk the goose. The goose does not wish to be bonked. I guess actually having a water bottle is good because I can use water bottles uh, with brewing stands to make potions. Even though I don't yet have the requirements to make a, a potion yet. I don't have nether wart, but I will have nether wart at some point, so it's fine. Okay. Shit. Motherfucker. I need to clear out my inventory a bit again. Which is annoying because I have so much crap in it still. Cleared out some of it. Oh, not having the chisel mod hurts. Oh, there goes my my shovel. Sandbar predicted the future again. This is quite peaceful, actually. I mean, if I fish for enough fish, that might solve my food problem. Isn't there- there's a villager type that, um, trades fish, right? He needs barrels or something, I think. But I forget. Oh, an eh, 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 eh. Poor fair fish. So I could maybe set one of those up at some point, get more emeralds. of mending. Or at least, you know, other, like, fishing rods and stuff. Where's me treasure? Where's me treasure? Where's me teeth? Where's some teeth? Give the orcs some teeth, yeah? Bloody fish. What do I look like? A fishmonger? Bloody git.
I am aware of how pointless it is to have like a dedicated pool in where there's like the ocean right there. I am aware of that is probably very dumb looking. But look, I am a goose. I am not known for being clever, okay? The goose is here for an aesthetic time, not a clever time. But doesn't it look nice to have a, a bunch of stone brick there instead of, you know, shit. Please validate my existence, Savage. <laughs> Freshwater goose, not salt water goose. Yep, yep, yep. I like ponds, not oceans. Yep, yep. Geese do not like the ocean, it is full of seagulls and nasty fish. <laughs> Just like a pond full of algae and worms and weird things. <laughs> Where people come by and give them bread and peas. You can't really give, you can't really go out in the middle of the ocean and give a goose peas and bread, can you? <laughs> this is why geese prefer the pond. Not to say that geese couldn't take over and control the seas if they wanted to, it's just... They don't want to. Heh <laughs> heh, ball. Another fish? Yum yum yum. One more attempt, and then I'll build some more stuff with this. Damn you, son. Damn you, reality. All I wanted to eat was, was, much, was to eat as much chocolate as I wanted and turn into a giant ball. Is that too much to ask? set up a chest over here as well so we can kind of put our random spools in a chest just here so fish 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 wall tripwire hook can the goose sleep now nope goose cannot sleep no sleeping for the goose I guess and the goose must remain awake forever sag Okay, uh, 20 blocker. See, it's a Minecraft stream where I build something. Te I mean, it's not a huge build, but it is a build. Six blocks left. Uh, I guess I'll put those in a chest or something somewhere. So, I need to solve for X. There we go. Should make it a bit easier to fish now. I don't know if depth or anything factors into the luck with fishing. I don't know how any of that works, um, but I figured it's going to be a lot easier to fish in a pool where the fish actually winds up in my inventory rather than falling back into the ocean. 
I mean, it floats now because the in and I guess over the past few years they've added floating infantry item mechanics into Minecraft, so things float on water. But still, it's kind of annoying when you fish something up and instead of coming into your inventory, it just goes blee boink back in the water because it clips on something, it bumps into a block or something. You know, it's like for fuck's sake. Don't you just hate it when you fish something up and the fish goes nah and nope, it's back into the water? I don't get how these fish are swimming through like solid matter though. That's that's pretty fucking weird. Feck me nearly spilled half a can of Bepis on my mouse. Holy shit! Is the Bepis okay? Are you okay? Is the mouse okay? How- I hope everything's alright over there. God, I want to get some more Bepis. My throat is kind of hurting now. And it's dry from dehydration. Or it's, or it's hurting from the fact that I keep making orc fucking noises. Yeah, mate. Fucking git. Mouse okay, Bep is okay. Bard okay? Question mark? A stick. Well, I hope I can trade that stick with something. All things should be wet or wet. All things dry, still dry. Good to hear. Bard never, okay. Oh, Sag. I want to paper pat and cuddle the bard now. Paper pat, but send bard. Bless your little cotton or other socks. Or bless your feet if you're not wearing socks. Is that weird to bless someone's feet? I don't know. Bless your something. Bless you. Okay, um. We have a bon. A pointed stick. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? The rarest thing in, in the world. Pointy stick. Yo, villager. Yo, dude. Dude, come here. Oh, thank you, cow. The cow just pushed the villager into into my general direction. How did the weaponsmith wind up in here? I mean, I'm not complaining, but how did you get in here? Why are you... Oh, why is the toolsmith in here now as well? Are we going to learn how to defend ourselves against someone armed with a banana first? Um... Yes. Game volume is quite loud, FYI. Oh, right. Hang on. It's not that loud for me, but maybe I'm just deaf. I'll turn it down to a healthy 70%. I think also it's on loud so that I can hear shit, like mobs and whatnot. Yeah, it was a little loud, actually. Wait, did I actually change anything? Yeah, I did. It's like, if I don't have the volume on loud, I can't fucking hear the, the nuanced little tiny sounds that some things make. Okay. Alright, you bastard. That's a bit better, cool. <laughs> By no means is it going to be perfect, but it's going to be alright. Everything's going to be okay. Everything's going to be okay, Dave. Deafened by sugar cane! 
I mean, I guess there's worse things to be deafened by, right? Okay. I think I'm gonna call the stream there because I, I've been streaming for like two hours. And I guess because they're streaming now, I'm gonna raid Yoran. So, uh, I'm gonna make this Stricker Cane into a thing. I'm probably gonna do some off stream quality of life stuff in the meantime. But yeah, we're gonna call the stream here today. So thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for watching on stream and on twi on twi uh, YouTube. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, follow if you've not followed already on Twitch, uh, twitch.tv slash And uh, yeah, see you guys in the next one. Goodbye folks. I'm going to make sure I get Yoran's name right. Oh, almost got it wrong. There we go. So give your a big old goose uh, for me. Go and honk at him or them. Honk at them. Honk at the Yoran. I'm not assuming you're doing anything. Honk at the Yoran. Yep, yep, yep. Oh boy. Oh boy, Sam Bard. Time for honks. Don't pull a daff. What do you mean, don't pull a daff? Never mind. I should have known. Long after you're gone, I still have much to learn from you, Suma. Thank you. Hey, Arctic Jacksack. Welcome in, Goosey. Welcome in, Raiders. Thank you for the raid, Goosey. Honk! Goose raid. Stand Bard, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Hmm. Seeds. We are exploring, uh, uh, the world of League of Legends without actually playing League of Legends. Because... I don't want to play League of Legends. <laughs> Go Thank you, Noble. I don't have a bot, so I can't. Seeds? Uh, uh, maple seeds. Do geese eat maple seeds? I don't know. There's a, there was a pouch of maple seeds and an orb of pure wind energy in this chest. Uh, Do you see anything new? Bard, I, I'm sorry, I do play League, I just do not stream League. I don't want... I don't want to, like, full disclosure, I, I do play League. Not often, I haven't played it that much, like, I don't play it by myself, but I'm not gonna stream League of Legends. That's not something that I think would be, would be good to see. I like the lore, though. <laughs> in villagers who don't give them books of men. Yes, maple seeds. My brother gave me seeds when I was younger. I gave them to Talia. In my school, the seeds represented patience. Uh, do geese eat patience? Because the seed represents patience. Goose was wildin' on the villagers. I hope that there are still villagers left, and maybe he actually gave them beds so that their shops will restock. Oh no, goose seat villagers who don't give them books of mending. Oh, patience. Uh, you do consume patience. Waiting was never an option. Oh dear. Uh, well, in that case, I guess goose would try and get these seeds. Oh. Uh, that reduces max health by quite a bit, but increases damage. Last I saw they were yeah, gathered in a pen like farm stock. Yeah, that's that's last I saw as well. Yeah, the the Fletchers in the animal pen. And the rest were stuck in a well. How the tables have turned. Um increase crit. It does reduce my crit rating only by a little. Um, I'm going to enchant this coat with something. Will Smith and Armor also somehow got into the villager pen. Oh boy. Everyone's in the pens now. 
the number of things we're putting in there make a market but at the same time you want to keep the villagers a village as a village so to speak you could have like i don't know houses by profession i guess and then leave the nitwits to wander around the streets feels kind of cool but could do that is this the one i'm upgrading yeah this is the one i'm upgrading I don't know what they the do oh house is by profession. Yeah, like uh like you have all of the the Fletchers living in one house and like they've got beds, they've got the fletching stations, they've got room to move around. And then you've got a blacksmith's house with like the wet stones so that they they all have Oh, I'm I'm no expert on on villager breeding, but I I like the green the green shirts that the nitwits wear. I like the color green. Good color. Can I sneak past you, Mr. Turtle? Are you gonna gonna let me in? <laughs> 